I'm standing on the edge of Hilo Bay and uh, Hilo Town is behind me here. And unfortunately, Hilo has a problem and that's its bathymetry. And the problem is caused when tsunami waves come from anywhere around in the Pacific and they come to Hilo Bay, the bathymetry of Hilo Bay magnifies the tsunami waves. So it acts a little like a lens. The wave is coming across the ocean and it comes into the shallow water of the bay and just the shape of the bay and how it has a long shallow runoff makes the tsunami waves back up and become taller and taller and come into the bay. So there's been quite a few tsunamis that have come into Hilo Bay and cause a lot of devastation. Probably the most famous of that took place on the 1st of April 1946 and destroyed many of the buildings here in Hilo and people lost their lives. But there's been tsunamis since then that have done equal amount of damage. But fortunately, because of the April 1st 1946 tsunami, a tsunami warning system was set up. The Pacific Tsunami Warning Center was set up. So when tsunami events like earthquakes or volcanic eruptions close to the ocean floor or even large landslides create a tsunami, a warning can be sent to Hawaii and other places around the Pacific warning people that a tsunami may be on its way and that they should move to higher ground. So when a large event like one took place here not that long ago, there was a, a volcanic eruption in Tonga. A tsunami warning came here to Hilo and people had about nine hours to uh, move their stuff if they happened to be in a tsunami zone. As that nine hours passed, more monitoring was done of the tsunami wave so people could be updated of how serious the tsunami warning was and eventually by the time the wave reached here it wasn't very big at all and yet on some other parts of this island there was some damage boulders from the ocean being brought up into picnic grounds and stuff so hilo bay it's a really beautiful place on the big island of hawaii but it has a tsunami history and will continue to be threatened by tsunamis that are generated all around the pacific